Imagine today taking all the eggs you have in the house and all the meat too and anything with fat in it and making a great big dinner out of all of it. Then imagine not going to the supermarket to buy any of those things for the next 40 days. Well, that's what many people used to do today because today, as you may have already heard, is Pancake Tuesday. In some places today it gets called Mardi Gras, Fat Tuesday, like in New Orleans. In other places today is called Carnevale, goodbye to meat, like in Venice or Rio, both now famous for big street celebrations. Meanwhile, in Britain, well, we've got our pancakes, not quite the same as Rio, I know, but our annual encounter with flour and eggs and butter is still good, clean fun. But today has another name in English, one that really lets us know what all the fuss and fun is about, and that other name for today is Shrove Tuesday. Shrove is to do with shriving, and shriving is about confession, being honest about just how much overindulgence in every department there has been in your life recently, fessing up and admitting it to your confidant, your confessor, or whomever helps you to be honest with yourself. That's because today is supposed to be the last day of fat and fun before tomorrow and its 40 days, because tomorrow is Ash Wednesday and the beginning of Lent. Like so many things in our calendar, they are partly there because of our country's Christian heritage and partly because this is a good time of the year to do these things. And after all we've been through in lockdown since Christmas and the binging, whether it be binging in box sets or binging from the fridge, there comes a time when enough is enough. We know that our bodies and our souls can all get too much of a good thing. And so tomorrow's an opportunity to get back into shape, body and soul, and maybe just in time for Easter. But today, fire up the pancakes, get out the butter, and have a great day. Bon appétit. <laughs> and to you too, Archbishop Leo Cushley. Thank you.